That's where I'm starting here, right now, here, right now, today. Hey there, Scott Goblin, Mal X3. Fun facts! These sprites represent Holo and, uh, Waddle. You can probably tell which is which. Um, yeah, their text here? Uh, this represents- because so these two are former judges that had to, you know, like, bail out for personal reason, which is all fine and good. This level I played yesterday, City Scrape, uh, were both voted their least favorite amongst the level they played, so that's kind of funny. Um, the three clock here is a legitimate programming error, from what I understand, so that's pretty cool. And the level itself, from what I understand, was designed by a 15-year-old, which, while it doesn't excuse anything, does kind of explain a lot, however. <laughs> Alright, let's get that second star. So that switch makes it so that the level's in a completed state. Uh, let's go and hunt down that elevator. Oh, there's a new switch. Yeah, right here. Okay, and from what I understand, that might have lifted up the elevator. Finally! Alright, I can do it. Here we go, getting in the sewage. Hopefully this won't last too long. Oh, it's... Okay, no, not quite. Uh, uh, that would be pretty good. Uh-huh. This was the name, alright. Okay, I can say they have been somewhat... Uh-huh. Alright. Uh-huh, okay. Alright. One heart. One heart is good. Warnings. Uh, so kind of, okay, well, you know, so far so good. Torpedo Teds. They're being shot at. Oh no, what am I going to do? Uh, going to lightly tap jump, and lightly tap jump on the top. And then we got that square up there, throwing Rinka down. What are we gonna do about it? What are we gonna do about leaves that stick to their trees in the middle of the night? Uh, Don? Oh, hey, look at that! It's a big ol' laser rainbow! Yeah? Oh, I did it! I dodged their laser rainbow! Those are player cuz. Alright. Uh, okay. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's Flanders. Uh, I mean, calling this a boss is being pretty generous. Alright, well, I did it! Wow, yeah, that was just like the epitome of I'm gonna attack an extra thing at the end of my very long level. I don't know. I dodged a couple of Rinkas and stuff. Never done that before. Let's just leave that behind us. Here we go, 14th place in Math Found. Dazzling Light blinds you in your very marrow, in my bones. I feel extreme dentistry. Ew, my fluffy meatloaf. Hi, Zatsu score. We can look at this very quickly. I'm not seeing any teeth in any of these. Well, let's go. Boss time with an award at the end. Oh, geez. Well, there goes that boo guy. Oh yeah, that's kind of neat though, because like, uh, I gotta break his teeth! Oh, and he's like watery. Like, you'll just land by destroying his teeth, right? So, okay, now I get to be the princess. I get to be inside this door? I don't know. I don't know what is going on. I got a bomb. There's something really gross about this. I kind of hate it. <laughs> this is pretty neat though. Alright, so change! Aw oh, man, I'm sword guy. Jelly bean! All right, yeah, 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 see, we got, like, different sorts of, oh, jeez, uh, yeah, 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 see, so you gotta make room for destruction, sword, sword attack, all right, I guess I'm gonna keep changing, it's pretty fun, I'm Wario, all right, so is there, like, the Wario room and stuff, I know, so you go here, and you're like, I'm gonna sit down on these tooth. That's a normal thing to say. Hammer on the slime. Oh, jeez. Uh, wait, so you don't hurt me? Wait a second. I'm so sorry. I don't know if I would have gotten hurt from now till then, though. Um, man. You know what? No, I'm not gonna take a chance. I'm not gonna take a chance. I don't think I got hurt, but I don't know. So here we go. Let's do this again. 
Yeah, see, this is pretty much the same, so, uh, uh, uh-oh. Wario has issues going up high enough here. Um, yeah, this is kind of a bother. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. So I'm getting kind of used to Wario over time. It's pretty good. So I don't have to switch, is what I'm hearing. Okay, like, you are given an option. I don't know, like, I feel like they each have their own, maybe, I think. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Because then I can go here, so now it's, Yeah, so see, it's the ice person again, with a very droopy lip. Uh, be careful about the lip. You know, that's what they keep saying. And the academy. Whoops, I got pained. Well, I want that again. Yeah, big old nice hat. Uh, ready for war. So I'm the princess again. Yeah, see, we got like, ooh. We got a new version. Oh, this is, I, I got a kind of a teeth thing where teeth make me like, uneasy. And this is all about breaking teeth. There's so many slimes here on the ground. What are y'all doing here? Like, celebrating the birthday of a man that doesn't exist. Oh shoot, how did that happen? Wait, did you just scroll around there, Tooth? The, the Tooth Fairy? Oh shoot. This is kind of weirdly hard, but pretty weird. Alright, hey, we did it! Big door! Oh! So I feel like, yeah, like, like there might have been, like, versions that I did not encounter. Alright, so here we are, on the ground. Like, you will just not die, huh? But hey, this is like a boss. That's like a boss. <laughs> I just said something really stupid. All right, so destroy all of this. I feel like I might have been happier here with uh, more traditional hammers. But hey, let's just, just can you slime? Like I am just okay, okay, okay. So you hit once. Yes, when I thought. Then you can hit there. Uh huh. New slime. New era. All right. That's pretty cool. This is super weird. I don't know, don't ask too many questions. It's gonna bite ya. Nothing really matters. Oh jeez, I'm gonna get leukemia. Well, that's not a good thing. Uh, I guess I wanna be Wario. I'm Wario now. Oh, I see. We wanna get down. Here we go. We line up all these teeth. Uh, now we're going to Teeth Town. Uh, everything. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh. Uh, well, the boss isn't like that. Can I go anywhere else? Or am I supposed to destroy these? I don't know. All right, well, I'm hearing brow brow. Yeah, brow. Oh, no, he's coming back slowly and steadily. Okay. He just kind of snuck in. Yeah, it's kind of hard to jump up there without, um, touching the teeth by accident, I feel. All right, well, so far so good. Yeah, and I can't like scroll him back in. I just kind of have to wait for him to sneak back in. He's a, he's a very timid little giant goo monster. Oh, I just bopped it with my head. Oh, now he did a loud brow. All right, this is so weird. Like, I don't know if this is supposed to be like that. Oh, you can't jump on these, huh? Oh, I lost my combo attack. So now I'm super vulnerable and I died. That's broadsword! Pretty trivial when you know what's happening. Ooh! It's too bad I kinda lost that immediately. Ah. Uh, also, it's too bad that I don't like broadsword. Uh, I like him as a character, but as something you play, uh, uh, he is. He barely works. Yeah, that uh, I caused pain, which made the slime retreat. This is it. Dang it. Like, yeah, you gotta be able to make it in here, cause like, uh, I feel like, I don't know. I think it's just those slimes you can't hop on normally. You can hop on things. I think it's just these slimes in particular just have, you know, they, they don't want to get touched. Which you know, that's fine. This is so weird though, like, I, the, the way the pacing works here with the main boss retreating feels like something is broken, like, I'm sure it's not the case. It's just kind of what it feels like. I'm pretty sure Extreme Dentistry is the name of a video I gave once. Yeah, I did it. I knocked off that teeth. 
The cycle renews itself anew. Here we are, standing on this middle palisade. Dang it. Yeah. No. Okay. Then I can do my triple attack and get to freedom. Get out of here, teeth. I did it! <laughs> what a weird fight. I love it, though. Like, I love the whole thing. I, I'm... I feel like there are stages in the first half I haven't experienced, but like, I think they were like, made for the various forms of celebration that exist within the world. Uh, yeah, I'm not really seeing anything here, so let's check out what the envelope has to say. HISTORY! Character roulette similar to power roulette from Dynamite Hitty. Alright, that makes sense. Uh, Blobs, powerful jelly bean jars going on. Okay, okay. Uh, to make tea, the primary weak point by giving the one hack. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, you know what? That's pretty good. Uh, the judges, I guess, didn't really agree about the gimmick thing, but I think that's really funny. Really? Huh. <laughs> oh no! I thought this was pretty good. This was by far the best MathFab submission as of yet, up to now. Uh, second room was Wario. Oh really? Huh. Okay, so maybe I was just lucky in getting things that I could do. Fair enough, I guess. I Maybe I was just lucky and I had a good time because of that. Or maybe not. Hmm. Alright. I still think that the second half is weird. Uh, I'm, I'm glad there are two halves. But yeah, there's something like about it just retreats, then crawls back. I don't know. There's just something really weird about it. Like, may maybe, yeah. Maybe if it kept advancing so that it felt more like a risk. And not just slowly just putting its weak point on screen so it can be defeated. Hmm, I don't know, I thought, honestly, I thought the images were fine. The blob were nice. Yeah, really fun. Yeah, I guess it would be really playable now that you think about it. Alright, I escaped crashes, so hey. I mean, wow, and... I'm, maybe it's because of further advancements in Smebex 2 since then, though. Mind you. <laughs> I mean, it, it felt very WarioWare in practice, more than anything. But it is true, though. Yeah, I do feel like a lot of them, you kind of have to get going, otherwise... You're just full of enemies in your face forever. Yeah. Alright. Alright, well, I mean, I had a blast with this and it won an award. Uh, we're aware of my dental hygiene, uh-huh. <laughs> the teethiest boss! Ooh, maybe I can do this. What do you have to say, Pyro? Oh, okay, this is just a no gimmick warning. All right, well, hey, you know what? Yeah, let's get to it. 78th by Snowy Dessert, Manga Mario. Uh, pretty high, honestly, other than a slightly lower Zatsu. Yeah, two clocks, sure. Let's give it a shot. Look at that, we're doing multiple things today. Whoa, look at that! Yeah, we are in a man. That is so rad. Oh, I love the presentation immediately. Cave story music. My favorite manga. I know how to pronounce words. It's fine. Don't think about it. Yeah! Here we go. This is some sequential art. Oh, uh, you can't jump on a crab. It's from a, a gag story. Well, I guess that is fine. Look at this. This is pretty sweet. Uh, the water is moving on its own, and that crab is there to be eaten. Uh, you know, you. the funny thing, though, Something I'm noticing immediately is that it's still very s sequential. 
Like, you could totally play with, like, repetition or going, like, between, like, very wildly different areas. Uh, but I don't mind. That's just nitpicking. But it's just, like, something I immediately noticed. Alright, we're going in some kind of house. I'm not getting that money over there. Potable's gonna burn the pages. Please don't do that. Oh man, it's a Goomba and there's a turtle down there. Look at that plant. It is now gone. Twimp is pretty heavy. But it is a thwomp. I don't know how I misspoke that. It doesn't matter. Squish the Goomba. You can't go up this pipe. Uh oh, here we're gonna do a time jump. I don't wanna die. Uh, yeah, here, here we go. That was a panel with coins and little else, yo. Hit the dynamite and then we affect the world. No, yeah, this is breaking the fourth wall, something major here, yo. Oh, I love it. I can't go there. That, that panel board is just too big. Kind of a double exclamation above there. I don't know if that means anything. Uh, look at that. A mushroom for me. And that Goomba is just dancing happily. Then the poison mushroom left me be. It just sinks through the world and goes to Gaspizzi. Where it's never heard from anymore. Lost in the theater of the mind. It's a little bit tragic, but we will make it in due time. Yo, check it out. This is a little bit longer than maybe it needs to. But I'm loving this bop, and it's such a cool way to separate a bop, to segmentalize a bop. And look at that, there's Boom Boom up there. He's a good guy now, cause it's a statue and statues. No, no, oh, oh, oh. he's not a statue anymore. Yeah, he ain't a good guy anymore, cause see, statues do not have morality. But the people they represent, maybe so. Ah, uh, that's right, violence begets violence. Now I can enter this door. Diagonal lines like that normally implies we're changing through the scene repeatedly, or it's happening at the same time. So I don't know what that tells about that part. That's pretty weird, actually. Yeah, like, this is so cool. But, like, this, oh, I, I, this could be pushed a slight, whoa, slightly a little bit more. But I am super happy with what I'm going through right now, though. Like, I'm not complaining. I just, it's so good that, ah, that I can see what you could do with it, bit some more. I got a shell in my hand, I'm going to kick it down the floor. Now I gotta hit that thing up there and I'm in danger. Yeah, I don't know if I care much about the lava below my... my manger? Yeah, sure. Yeah, that worked out. See? Oh. So where do I restart? That's the question. I was afraid of that. Really? It's just more money on this side, which is a lot more dangerous to get? Alright then. No! Oh my gosh. Really? Do I want to stay small so that jumping between these things is easier? Like, maybe, honestly. Like, this here is fine. The other one, though, is legitimately, like, super hard. It's made for someone who's playing with a keyboard. Oh my gosh. Like, this level is great! Yeah, I'm gonna choose to get hurt. Like, there's no obstacle. Like, if I get killed, it's by something that kills me in one shot anyways. <sighs> like, this is... This is very hard. Unless there's something I didn't see. But, like, I, I don't... Yay! Alright, now I can summon my mushroom back. 
Because we got a classic Rododo attack. The spiny two scuttling on the floor. Oh, it was at the end and everything is rotating in a weird way. Just one midpoint. Just one midpoint, man. It's all I want. This level is fantastic. It's just, you put the extreme, like the last thing you do in the level is by far the hardest thing. This is just me, are the colors popping weirdly after playing this thing in black and white for a while. And it's all lines. Man, imagine where it could have gone if you have gone if you have gone with the usage of gimmicks, but because it's a 20 points you've just lost. But at the same time, like, would you have made a level that's just as good if you were limited? I don't know. <laughs> you gotta read like a snake. Uh Yeah, this is was really good. It's uh it does boil down to very cramped platforming, but it's good cramped platforming, whatever that means. Uh, well, yeah, see, okay, yeah, so it's kind of strict has a point there. The size is not a reason, it really needs a midpoint. It's the fact that you got the by far hardest thing at the very, 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 very end. Yeah, and you're not really trained for it either, that's true, because the rest is a pretty if narrow bombity bop bop bop. Uh, Mm -hmm. Here we see people having differing opinions on what short means, but hey, that's fine. That makes sense. Look at those high scores. Well, except for the first one, which is like literally middle. No, not no. Middle would be 25. Still above middle. Like you kind of ran out of ideas at the end, in a sense. Maybe, maybe that's why. Maybe you just kind of went on a little bit longer than you should. Really, I I don't see why the poison mushroom generator on. Uh, like, was struck such a anti chord with you, but okay. And yeah, like, basically, that's the biggest crime. If you die in the extra hard last part, the more you play this, you do lose its charm. Like, it's. It, the charm works less and less, which is really unfortunate. But yeah, beautiful, compelling, no, yeah. This is really good. Whoa. Hanger? Manger? Unless I'm saying hanger wrong, which I guess is not impossible. Man! Today was so good, though! Today was fantastic! Next time we're going here. What is it gonna be? Oh, well, okay, well, next time we're probably gonna have a one-off. I mean... Hey, at least we gotta break it up a little bit with an anti one off. And after that, ooh, after that, we might actually play a few more levels again. I don't know. I'm getting a little bit too ahead. Resaving just out of wanting to press the save button at this point. <laughs>